Hello everyone, I am Turnabout Akamiya, uh, and since this is a Mech Warrior video, or going to be in a few minutes here, here I am also Akamiya Terrazin. That's what I've been calling myself since um, Mech Warrior for Mercenaries. He's, um, he's. So, for those of you who are unfamiliar with my earlier work, work on this channel, I did a Let's Play. My first Let's Play was of Mech Warrior 4 Mercenaries. He's Mech Tech Edition, the Mech Tech version of it, which was roughly t about two years ago. Oh, at least that's when it started. I finished it in it last year. Um, so that game series, well, Mech Warrior itself has. I pretty much grew up with that series. He's it's pretty much my history. He, um in video games anyway. So, I love those games to death. My first one was MechWarrior 2, who, 31st Century Combat. I skipped MechWarrior 3, and, uh, I could, and I tried to, I had to play it once, uh, once and it, I just couldn't get it to work. I, it was, I tried last year. Um, but, uh, at Mech Warrior 4, which I have a lot more hours on than I ever had in Mech Warrior 2, who works great and he and I loved that at a lot more than I ever or, or enjoyed Mech Warrior 2, to be quite honest. It's, it's a very solid game. So, oh, oh, it's been a long time since I had done anything Mech Warrior, so. And because I love Mech Warrior Four so much, at least, or I figured it would be good to do who the series justice by is by playing the original Mech Warrior Four, Mech Warrior Four Vengeance, and its expansion, Mech Warrior Four Black Knight. Right, I have both games installed, hold on my Windows Virtual Machine. Same with Mercenaries. He's and I and I. I have the I had the Inner Sphere and Clan mech packs uh, acts installed, but I couldn't get them to work. But even if I could get them to work, um, they uh, it really wouldn't matter because they wouldn't uh, they, it wouldn't impact the campaign at all. I couldn't get the I would not be able to use the use the new mechs there or weapons. So <laughs> let me just, so this preface is over. Er, you guys want to see he battle mechs? So, let's get to it. Powers Command, this is 4-1. We've sighted a second overlord touching down. We have heavy casualties. Enemy units still moving in on the palace. Please advise. Hold your position, 4-1. We're mobilizing palace defenses, but we need time to evacuate the royal family. Roger, Command. We'll do our best. Who the hell are they? Alert. Palace is under attack. All units, and your station. Next warrior, you are cleared to mobilize and engage at them. Gunnery, you are authorized to fire at incoming hostiles. Area, back palace personnel, rally point echo immediately. We've got uh, these four lenses up the wall, four units. Looks more to like LRM launches. Sigma lead, this is Sigma 2. Any idea what we're up against? Well, it could strike forces. Probably the 5th Donegal. That's my old unit. Why would our own forces attack us? It was inevitable. Everything has changed. Sigma Lance, warm up on my lead. Central Guard is Sigma Lance Leader. We're moving out. We have the Royal Family aboard. We can't lift off until those Sam Lances are taken out. Incoming LRMs. 
Get clear. Look out! Get out of the hangar! Get track of those damn launchers. I got track! Take them out! Impact! Nice shot, Sig-2. All right, on my mark. We break off and head for the central courtyard. We'll go back and try to regroup. Incoming. Activate AMS! Sir! I got my right now! Oh my! Get out of the way! Sig-2, this is Lance Leader. Do you read? Karras! Can you hear me? Sentry Guard, is Sigma Leader. What's your status? Command, this is Sigma Leader. I've lost contact with Central Guard. Enemy receiving unit. I have contact with main enemy force inside Central Courtyard. I'll delay them here as long as I can. Well, that was just, it was pretty itty. I don't know, brutal, I guess. And in all that, I realized I forgot to plug in my in my USB mouse. So if you'll excuse me for a moment, uh. There we go. Okay. Let's see. So, there's gonna be quite a few cutscenes here, so... I'm gonna have to, like, cut myself out... Uh, out... Out when, uh, whenever they show. Also, my face cam will not be in the, um, mech piloting scenes where I'm actually driving. So... In, I mean... In, uh, I know, I mean... When I originally did the Let's Play hey, of MechWarrior 4 Mercenaries, it was before I even had software that I could do the face cam thing in, in, in at all, but I just want to preserve the illusion, I guess, that, uh, as that I'm the one behind the in the pilot seat. So, yeah. yeah. And I suppose telling you that may have defeated the purpose, but I don't know. It's up to you. So, let's move on to the campaign, shall we? My son, I wish these did not have to be my final words to you. I must try to make up for years and only a few minutes while this message can still be sent. I've often regretted the words that I spoke when I sent you away. I don't want them to be the last that you hear from me. I was acting as a duke, not a father. I feared you'd bring dishonor to the family name. I was wrong. You may have thought yourself forgotten, but you've never been far from my thoughts. I've followed your deeds in the clan wars. You have done nothing but bring honor to your name and made me proud to be your father. If you could find it within yourself to forgive me, I'd hope to ask you to return home. Now there's no time, because I stood against Katrina Steiner when she betrayed her promises and seize control of the Commonwealth. Our world is to be made an example to the Dukes who stood with me in resisting her. They're seizing Katares. They've sent a strike force, 
It's only a matter of time before they breach the castle defenses. Your brothers, your sister. By the time you get this, I'm sure that we'll all be dead. Stay away from Katari's, Ian. Your Uncle Peter commands in the 4th Davian Guard off the planet. As long as he takes no action against her, Katrina won't risk moving against him. Go to him. Live on and bear our name proudly. My son, I have always loved you. And I am very, very proud of the man that you have become. Goodbye. Did you find the bodies? Do we know for certain they're all dead? Steiner executed everyone at the castle who survived the initial attack. We don't know where they're buried. We don't believe anyone escaped. I know what you must be feeling, Ian. But your father's wishes were always for honor and justice, never for revenge. Justice? My family's been killed, Peter. All but you. Whoever killed them deserves to be dead, too. But we've more important tasks first. We have to break Steiner's grip on Kentari's Four, then remove your cousin William from the throne and restore legal rule. William? He's only a puppet, Ian. Steiner controls your home world. Our forces are small, but if we show the people they can fight back, I know they'll join with us and free Kentari's. So, if you're your father's son, you'll get suited up. Our first strike must be now, before they discover we're here. All right. <clears throat> so, just in case is someone uh, someone missed the memo at uh, and I'm sure most of you didn't and you people are very very bright right hate hate the ga the game takes place I mean really all of the mech warrior 4 games games take place around uh, the time of the fedcom civil war which is a canon event although the game uh, oh, 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 the game mech warrior 4 games in general are quite um questionable on their canonicity at various points. It's, um, it's, but uh, they do get some things right, and right, and in this case, uh, there was a, uh, was a conflict between the Federated Commonwealth and the... And the uh, I'm getting them mixed up. The Federated Sons and the Lyran Commonwealth, or House Davion and House Steiner. Uh, uh, Steiner? Um, er? We're playing as Ian Drasari, uh, the son of a duke who was, uh, who was affiliated with House Davion. On, um, on, so, on, uh, on, so, when we hit Black Knight, uh, well, I'll tell you later. So, yeah. Let's see. Mech lab. Okay, so our only mech right now is the forty-ton, forty-five-ton Shadow Cat. Uh, we're stuck at the stock loadout. Out, but I can still repaint it. So. Let's see. Uh, um, what is Royal Harrier? There is a fun color. <sighs> I don't know if I like this weapon grouping. It'll do for now. At least until I make my make my own build. Um. Yeah. Okay. So. I forgot what my video settings were, but uh, but I think my screen resolution is at the resolution uh, is out at the highest I could do for uh, that for the, this game. So. 
Also, am I the only one who notices that the maps are kind of... I don't know. I didn't notice this. Before. I didn't notice it before uh, it, when I was younger, but uh, now I notice that the, the transitions between e in these parts of the, these different map pieces is aren't exactly seamless. But all right, all right, all right, all right. We we don't have any transmissions. I mean, it means if if a transmission sh ugh, transmission shows up, I'll let it play. So okay, first mission. Because I know uh, I'm stalling. Not intentionally stalling, just bear with me. This is it, gentlemen. We're about to start a war. Ahead of us is the main com relay station. It's lightly defended and should be a piece of cake. Destroy it, and all Steiner communications with Kentarius 4 are cut off. Expect light point defenses only. Move in fast and vaporize everything that isn't a rock. Except each other, that is. Yes, except each other. And your lance mate on this mission is Casey Knowles. You learn to ignore him. The rest of us do. Casey, the shadow cat to your right is my nephew. And your future duke. Try to show him more respect than you do me. Don't think that will be a problem, sir. Those towers are the communication relays. We better take them out first. It may take heavier weapons to bring them down. Okay, uh, I think I need to, I, need, I think I need to raise my video settings just a bit, because <laughs> this resolution is not, not going to work out very well. Like also, punch punch, I need to, to I think I forgot damage. when I was setting. Oh, in some Steiner. oh yes, good old, difficult. Uh, um, so, yeah. Destroyed. I failed to failed to uh, set up my uh, up my uh, movement controls to, was to make my torso twist with the mouse, which is to destroy. So I'm gonna have to do that do that after I'm done with this video. Um, Omega Lines, we show vehicles moving out of the facility. Neutralize all mobile units. They might warn other starter forces. Roger that, Control. I thought these guys were supposed to be tough. <laughs> oh, how I missed this. up so let's do that. Ugh, fuel tanks. Keep your eyes open and check your target. APC. Kill it. Oh, another APC. I didn't notice that for a moment there. I was so too busy looking at my... Okay. Communications towers. Let's blow them up. That's one! It's not close. That'll blow up on its own. Okay. Now I've got control. 
So we got some got some weapons. Mm -mm. We didn't get it at any new mechs, unfortunately. All right, we've bloodied their noses, even if they won't know it right away. With communications cut, we'll be able to move in secrecy for a while. From here on, I want you to take a command role with the team. They need to start seeing you as their leader. So I'd like you to determine our next mission and get us set up. I've uploaded our TAC officer's operational overview. It's simple enough. Steiner only left a few dropships behind, and all but one are hangered here on the moon, where it's safe. Before we hit dirt side, we'll need to destroy the dropships to cripple the mobility of Steiner's defensive forces. We also have to raid additional supplies from some of the remaining lunar facilities. They're undefended. The only threat to those raids are Steiner mobile artillery units. They'll have to be neutralized before we can start our raiding operations. All right. I've asked Carl Sontag, our technical officer, to configure mechs for the missions. Now, Carl's a good man, and one hell of an engineer. Your father used to say, give Carl a hundred tons of steel wool, and he'll knit you an atlas overnight. Change the loadouts if you want to, but I doubt you'll improve on his choices. We're all waiting for your orders, Ian. I know you're up to the challenge. Yes? Good news. Tactical just informed me that the techs have pulled Steiner encryption codes out of the mess we left behind at the comm facility. We'll be able to intercept enemy communications, well, some of them anyway. We should also be able to locate other pockets of resistance. We should start getting some useful information in the next few hours. I'll keep you updated. Hello, Carl. It's been a long time. I didn't know if you'd remember me. I served your father for a long time, but the last time I saw you, you were a boy. Duke Eric was a fine man and a great leader. We will miss him. I will miss him. He would have wanted better for you, but I'll give you the best I can. I've modified our mechs by stripping out some of the heat sinks. The heat dissipation in this environment is so efficient, they'd just be erased. You won't need much speed for these missions, so I've added extra armor, just in case. Not much weaponry to choose from yet, but that will change soon enough. Bring in any good weapons or material as salvage, and I will keep you ready to fight. I kept your father's mechs in shape for him. I'll do the same for you, young Grisari. Okay, is that it? Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, before we you continue, let me just do something. Options. Nope. I, I thought I changed that, but apparently I was mistaken. Okay. By the way, um, um, because because this came up in uh, 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 up in the comments section of ones of one of my uh, let's play videos for uh, Mech Warrior Four Mercenaries, uh, this is regular difficulty. Here, the uh, my let's play of Mech Warrior Four Mercenaries was recruit, and the reason for that is because that's what I'm I'm used to. Um, so I'm probably more likely to die here in an air because I'm playing on regular than I am likely to die uh, was in uh, mercenaries. So yeah, okay. Here, just... All right, uh, bloody their nose. I know. Okay, so because I went to all that trouble, let's just go ahead and continue on. I mean. Th that last mission was actually pretty short. Um, hurt, and my Mech Warrior episodes tend to be pretty long anyway. Before we continue, let's modify our mech. Uh, let's see. Uh, 
on second thought, let's wait. Because I don't like our, like our options at the moment. It's, so... Let's see. Uh, okay. Let's go. Got that uh, 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 that uh, uh, ought to uh, change the uh... sir. I've got a visual on a mech. Must be an escort. Let's take him out. <laughs> yeah, I completely forgot to change the aims, the resolution. Uh, my mistake. Target destroyed. I'll make a note of that for next episode. Target destroyed. Like, like I literally just. Go, uh, go and change it. Uh, if it can be changed to be any better when I, get, uh, or when I get done recording this one. So, okay. Got here Cyrus. Nothing, nothing too difficult. Nitroglycerin uh, in, in of video games and movies. Okay, so. Do we really have to wipe out everything in Gonzalez? You're a bit trigger happy. Or, should I, or rather, the AI is. But. Target destroyed. It is the early 2000s, though. Oh, video game AI was pretty freaking stupid at the time. I've got a contact to hit, sir. Did that show up after we blew up everything? I, I'm pretty, I'm extremely oblivious today, apparently. Nav point beta reached. So I guess maybe everything, maybe destroying everything was necessary. Osiris. What? It, uh, did. Oh, the, the devs felt the need to specify. Target destroyed. Whatevs. He's dead anyway. 
He's dead to me. Okay. Up and over. <laughs> All right. And around. Destroyed. Roger, Gonzalez. I think we got them all. Control, this is Omega-1. We've run the pattern. All units neutralized. Roger, Omega-1. Good work. Return to base. Omega support begins salvage operations. See if there's any ammo to recover. Carl can use anything we can possibly repair. Window, three hours. Roger, Control. Starting salvage operations. Epsilon 2 sweeps complete. You're clear to begin operations at Thorless Basin. Roger, Control. Moving out. Good work, Lieutenant. Pleasure working with you. Same here, Gonzalez. I'm happy with any mission I can walk back from. Roger. Oh, would you look at that? We got an Osiris. Yes. I wonder how good, how useful that'll be later. Yes? It's Jules Gonzalez. Good work out there. Keep it up. I talked with Colonel Sharp. He said you were blooded against the clans. I guess that means you've seen heavy action. I saw my share. That's good. What we've run up against so far is minor compared to what we'll find down in Cantares. And that's straight from the Colonel. I just didn't want you to think it was always going to be this easy. I figured. Maybe we'll live through this. Young Dressari, just so you know, I have adapted the gear you brought in as salvage for use with our mechs. Good work. It's nice equipment. Steiner shops well. Once we get planet side, there will be more. And more need of it. Hey, Ian. Hey, I was surfing the airwaves and thought you might enjoy this. Sounds like some kindred spirits down on Kintaris. The oppression of the illegal Steiner occupation force does not go unchecked. Across our planet, small patriots are struggling to overthrow the Steiner tyrants and their puppet pavilion. Do not be fooled by Steiner's puppet. Their claims that yesterday's communications interruption was the result of an inconvenient mechanical failure are lies. Military and defense networks were neutralized by one of the many resistance rising in style. Take part, loyal citizens. Enemy invaders on our soil are not as powerful as they would have us be. Okay. Looks like that's done. Well, we're going to save dropship hunt for next time because this video has probably gone on pretty long already so oh, uh, annotations aren't work I I don't have an end card yet anyway so hey so when I and there won't be any credits at sequence for this one for those familiar with my mercenaries these playthrough who there, there won't be there won't be any credits this time I, the only I mean I started it because I thought that was the thing to do, but but then later on I realized that is that it wasn't really necessary exactly. So I so uh, I, the only reason I kept going with it was because of consistency. So he so no 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 credits. <laughs> it's at the end. Uh, but I will see you next time. I turn about alchemy out.